Hey guys, it's been a while. It's Steve O for Dog Day Gaming here. Today I'm going to be showing you what I've been doing lately in Seven Days to Die. Let's just start up my my uh, world. It's not the original world; it's a randomly generated one. So here's my world. I just got scared of dude coming up, but um, he's all right. Oh, he's going away. Don't need to chase him. Okay. Then we'll go down to my base. That's where those trees are. This is my base. Oh, well, my beginning base. See, I was in one. I was in one of those small little um houses down there. That was my very first base, but then I decided I need more room, so I said I'd make my own house, and I made it on stilts, and it was really good, and um, I'd stand out here on this ledge on horde night, and I had blades all around, I had blades and wood spikes all around here, and they'd just come in and get decimated. The screamer, there is she is, there she is. Yeah, they'd get decimated and killed off. But, um, yeah, as the game started to go on, I needed more room. And so I built a, a newer base. Well, actually, I think it's more of a, like an extension. Yeah. Ooh, oh yeah, that's glass paneling, yeah. Um, so yeah. So I decided that it wasn't... It wasn't as big as I needed it to be. So I watched a few YouTube videos and I saw this guy build a um a fall trap, a dead fall trap. So they'd fall like real long distances and, and like get injured, but then he'd have a blade down there that'd kill him off. Oh look at that. So I kinda liked the idea but I didn't want a um I didn't want a fall trap. So I built this instead. Oh, it looks like they got through. Must have been a roaming horde. But yeah. So I built this. And I bunker in there. I stand up top there. And I can shoot through the bars. And kill off the... Kill off the horde. Because they get chopped up, but sometimes they're still alive. Without any legs and arms, so you've got to throw some cocktails down here or shoot one of these exploding exploding darts but what the really cool thing about it is it took me forever to build come over here Sally boom where's my bike? oh I ran past oh yeah I need water Oh, to get plenty of water. Yep, this is this is where I first hunkered up, bunkered down for the first couple of nights. Just here. But yeah. So I didn't move that far away. Let's go back up to my my base. And I'll show you the real work of art. That's my wood, my wood farm. It's the only thing I. Is that a screamer? No. Yes, it is. Boom. Die. What? 
updated. Time for clean up. Cause I want that juicy juicy fat. Gotta love me some of that fat. What's he going on? playing a bit awkwardly today because I'm I'm used to sitting in my recliner chair playing but I'm playing up at a desk for the first time in about a year because my headphones can't reach that far so. well I'm starting to get a bit of damage on this here oh they took out a pillar Oh, I better get some building materials. This is where I that's what that's my bed, that's where I spawn if I die. Come down here. This is where I used to grab my 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 food. And that's where I used to keep everything. No, I'll still do keep a few things up here, just in case. No. But yeah, it got a bit too small. That's the Jenny powering all everything. I used to have 13 blades around the place, but um, yeah, not anymore. So then we come down to here. This is my base. I'm still working on it, I just started painting. So paint scheme's not um finalised yet. I'm in the process of growing and making paint. And you're wondering why I have a a bike only the ground? Because of this. Look at that, see? After this point, an auger was made. So everything before here was all made by pickaxe. Now this is my crafting area. See, got more boxes. More forges. I only had three when I was upstairs. And the screamers just wouldn't leave me alone, even when they weren't on. And this is where I keep my my stone and my metal. And over here is where I grow my grow my food. Here's my ceiling. You're probably wondering how I grow my food on the ground. You know, when I'm when I'm literally on bedrock. One one um one block below me is bedrock. I put dirt on dirt on top of bedrock so I could grow. But now what I did was I dug all the way up and I put bars at the top and I put bulletproof glass here so the light still gets through so I can grow my grow my food underneath the ground. Yeah, I've just started decorating the place. It's not fully, it's not fully decked out yet. But it's getting there. And 
And this is why I wanted a bike underneath the ground. Takes forever to get to. See? It's my mining shaft. So you come in here and mine away. And over here is my Horde Knight bunker. This is where I come Horde Knight. But I did something stupid. When I dug down, I didn't dig down straight. I, uh, I dug in a bit of an angle. So I have to get a little way station. There we go. This is all nice metal down there. See, and this is where I am. See Jenny on the side? So you can switch it on and go. Yep. Oh, prime target over there. Oh, missed him. Oh. I don't want that dude over there. Caught him, haha. <laughs> Dead. But yeah. So it's all linked up. Yeah. Oh, head up. And if you needed to get downstairs here, you can come come down through the door. I put a door here. I know the I know the the, the zombies come for the doors because they they see them as empty tiles. But. Sometimes you just need to get come out this end. Oh no, I left my left my steel back at base. Well, hay bales don't respawn. Take that food. Oh, Stompy, what are you doing there? Right up in my grill, man. Yeah, Heinz, no good. Oh, look at that dude. Look at that glitchy sometimes, hey? Take some glue. Nothing wrong with a bit of glue. Dude, you fat, look at that belly. I wondered if you use if you I like to use melee weapons when taking out taking out zombies and I take I take out the um wandering hordes which I've set to the maximum size number of like seventy six I think it is or something like that. And I'm wondering, does it cause heat? And every time you shoot with a gun it causes heat on your um on your tile. So yeah. So yeah. 
I'm gonna get max three. Way station for a port or something. I've never, uh, like, my um, underground base has never been breached. Um, they did, they did bust in the um, the door up there once when it was only a, a metal door, not reinforced. Um, and a big mama got up to me on the roof there. But I was able to, I was able to kill her and fix the door in time. And on this end, where my main um, above ground base part is, um, they breached it, um, took out a whole wall. Uh, but no zombies actually got down inside of my um, my bunker base. So yeah, so after that I reinforced the walls up there, so there's like, it's two or three rows thick now, so it'll be a lot harder for them to get in. As you can see, we've got a lot of torches around, so everything's nice and bright. Um, oh yeah, over here, this is going to be my kitchen area. I'm going to make a kitchen here, and I'm going to bust probably through here, right, and make a flight of stairs going up, uh, and I'm going to have a bedroom up there with my bed and everything in it. But what, we, uh, what I need to do now is grab some tokens. Go to a trader. Yeah, the um, the traders, the traders in these um, generated maps are randomly placed. So I knew the location of four, but since I stopped playing for about two weeks, I kind of lost track of them. So. I've gone out and explored a little bit more, found two, but I haven't fi haven't found the others yet. St stupid trapdoor, get up there! Thank you. Okay. Gotta be careful going down this road. I've come off at full steam and hurt myself. Now I'm pretty sure there's a trader down here. Should be able to see him just off the side of the road. Oh, I know they're going to close soon too, I bet you. Oh, 
Where's the entrance for it? You want? Come on! You got a you pain in the rear end, man. Uh. Oh, oh! Thank you. Damn! You don't even put me out front of your place. Whoa, what the, what the crap? Talk about double take. <laughs> Talk about just cutting on my bike in time. Book it out of here. Maybe I should give myself more time next time to get to the. Get to the trailer. Scream. I can't get it, hey. My. All my. All my. Oh, I don't know if you'd be able to see it in the dark. You see? This is where my my farm my farm is, my farmhouse is. Mm. So I still don't know why screamers are all the way over there near my Near my exit, it should be around here and here. Well, they tried to dig down there, but they can't get down. No, no, but they're over here. All right, she, she, she's back. Yeah, so this is my basic de base design, guys. Um, if you like it, uh, put a comment. And if you've got any suggestions, yeah, tell me about them below. And please like and subscribe to the video. And I'll be releasing more.
more seven days to die. Thanks guys.